Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Chloe Caldwell and my channel is all about travel and all the fun things in life, so of course. That includes big fashion hauls and I actually have a trip coming up to the Caribbean next weekend and I seriously am so excited. But of course, I can't go to a beautiful tropical island without some fun, colorful, floral pieces to take with me in my suitcase. So I did a little bit of a shopping spree on Petal & Pup. They're one of my favorite brands. They have so many like wedding guest dresses, tropical vacation outfits. They have all the kind of styles that I love. So a lot of dresses, a lot of like billowy sleeves, but I can't wait to show you guys what I got. This is just gonna be a really quick haul, but before we jump into the try-ons, make sure to like this video, comment if you like what you see, let me know if you have any suggestions or questions, and subscribe for more. Oh, and of course, I will link everything in the description below so that you can shop all these looks for yourself. Okay, first up is this really cute green button-up, and I just think that this color and this pattern could literally not be more perfect for a tropical island. I feel like I'm wearing a palm tree, and I love the sleeves. The thing with the Caribbean is that even though it can get really, really hot, it also can be very windy, so it's nice to have layers, so I can picture myself like wearing this over my bathing suit or just like out to dinner when it gets a little bit windier at night. And then I paired it with a black belt, a classic, you need one in your closet. And I also got these white shorts, which I feel like I needed some good white shorts just for like all my summer and spring styles coming up later this year. It's just a staple to have in your closet. And I feel like, especially for traveling, you just want to throw on something comfortable, throw it on over your bathing suit. I love this. I feel like it's like, casual and super easy, but also chic. And I would pair it with some like heeled sandals or maybe even flat sandals, depending on your plans for the day. These ones are just some easy block heels from Steve Madden that slip right on. So again, I can picture wearing this like at the resort for dinner, if you're going somewhere like casual, but you still wanna dress up a little bit. That's nice. By the way, I am filming this in my living room and kitchen because the lighting in my office right now is just not great. And it's not even that much better in here, but anyway, bear with me. Outfit number one, love it. Shop them at the links below. Sizing, let's see. This top, I'm wearing an extra small. I'm guessing I'm probably wearing the same size in the shorts. Doesn't say, but they've gotta be like an extra small or small. I'm usually in between those two sizes. These Steve Madden shoes, they're size seven. And Steve Madden typically runs a little bit small, so I always go like half a size up. I'm just wearing right now a little bandeau, lacy bandeau underneath it, but you really could wear a tank top, your bathing suit, anything underneath this, or tuck it into your shorts too. I was wearing it like that earlier, but I kind of like it with this cute little like tie vibe. But anyway, let me know what you guys think. Let's move on. If you know me, then you know I just absolutely adore the color pink and will take any excuse to wear a little pink dress. And I'm obsessed with this one from Petal and Pup. It's just like got this classic baby doll feel. It's so comfortable and like very lightweight. So on those extra hot days, you don't have to worry about just dripping sweat in your outfit. But I love this because it comes with this little bow on the back. So I feel like a little tropical island Barbie. And I know that I'm gonna wear this again like all summer long. It's just like a cute little easy dress. And I actually got a couple hats from my Petal and Pop haul as well. So I got this cute little like straw bucket hat type of thing. You can wear it kind of down like this or you can pull it up like that. But I think it goes so cute with this little dress. Like I can picture myself just like walking down the beach, going to the little resort shops, you know, perusing, browsing my next purchase <laughs> and just exploring the town with my camera and with all my tourist accessories. I just think that this is like adorable. I'm obsessed. And again, the little bow makes it like a little extra girly. I just can't wait to take pictures in this because I feel like it's gonna be like the ultimate beach photo at sunset moment in this cute little dress. So stay tuned for that. But again, shop it below. I think I'm wearing an extra small in this. Hat is just one size. I think this is gonna be really nice for wearing to the pool and the beach, obviously, or like on those days where I really don't feel like washing my hair after getting it wet, like in the pool and whatnot, I can just throw this on. So love, love, love. Let's move on. Okay, this one is just loud, colorful. I can imagine wearing this like out on the town, maybe if I go out to the bars at night, like it's just, it just makes me wanna dance and twirl. And I also love all the cutouts on the side and it's pretty low, so it's like kinda sexy 
has this really open back so you can show some skin, show off your new tan lines. I've never really been like a maxi dress girly and I think it's because I'm really short. Like I'm only 5'2", I've got really stubby short legs. <laughs> but I think maybe as I've gone like a little bit older, I've learned to appreciate longer dresses and just kind of like find the right shapes for me. And I am loving this. Give you guys a closer look at the cutouts and this like center chest piece. Can't really wear a bra with it, so. This might be more for my itty bitty titty committee girlies like me, but I just love it. It's so colorful. It has this like sexy front slit. There is just a lot of skin, but it's also classy. It's like very extra of me, but I also bought this oversized straw hat, which, okay, this is screaming tourist, but I'm kind of obsessed with it. It's like tourist chic. I feel like a rich middle-aged mom. You know what I'm saying? Which gonna be more opposite of who I am currently as a person, but it's like live action manifesting. Anyway, I think that this is so cute. I definitely will wear this hat too, like to the pool, on my morning walks. Like I think I can get some really cute pics with this big hat. You know, like some cute pics in my bikinis, out the pool or on the beach. I think it's gonna be really cute. I'm kind of obsessed. I love this outfit. I feel like I'll wear this to like a nice lunch in the sunshine after the beach. I'm a big fan. This is like so cute. Okay, last outfit, let's go. This is a petal and pup dress I've actually had for a while now, but I love it so much. I'm definitely packing it in my carry-on, so I had to show you guys. I've worn this to like a couple weddings and on vacation before, and I'm just obsessed. Let's see. It's a longer length, like midi right above the ankles, and it has these ruffles and layers within it, and then this really like stretchy, comfortable bodice. I also, of course, love the puffy sleeves. If you know me, you know that I am all about things girly style. I love bows, I love puffy sleeves, I love pink, all the girly things. That's kind of my style and I definitely bring that into my vacation wardrobe. I also like the top of this because you can do like an off the shoulder vibe if you want, like especially when it's hot. This is a little bit thicker, but again, it gets windy at night and it, you'd be surprised at how chilly it might get in the Caribbean. I feel like this would be really nice for like a, uh, final night dinner, you know, something a little bit nicer. I'm all about the long, pretty dresses these days, like I said. And of course, I love the color, the deep green. It's very bright, but still a little bit understated. So not too over the top, because it has a lot going on already. And all of these dresses I just paired with my favorite, Andrew Asu, I think that's how you say it, wedges. They're really cute, really simple, tan, got that like straw wedge. And they're really comfortable. I literally have had these for maybe a year now and I bring them on literally every single vacation. So I'll link those below as well. But yeah, that's the final fit. I'll give you the full 360. Simple, modest, cute, whatever it might be that you might want something a little bit more modest, this is perfect. And again, for like destination weddings, love. I wore this to a wedding in Tahoe with this like hot pink heels. It was perfect, I loved it, it was a hit. Very cute. Okay, so I know that was like a super quick haul. My background is definitely not aesthetic at the moment and the lighting is crazy. But I did just really wanna make you guys have a quick video because I'm obsessed with these pieces and I truly will wear them all spring and summer long. I have so many beach trips this spring and summer. I cannot wait to bring you guys along. I'm gonna be making travel vlogs of every single trip. I'm starting big next week in the Caribbean. And I'll let you guys know where I'm going next week. So make sure to stay tuned on my Instagram. I'm going to Hawaii. I'm going back to the Caribbean. I'm going to Mexico. This year is like all about beach travel, which is why I wanted to stock up on all of these amazing pieces. And yeah, I love Petal and Puff. This is not sponsored. I want it to be though. So make sure to like and interact with this video. I love you guys. And I'll catch you next time. Mwah.